hi guys happy new year welcome back to my channel i'm still at Jane. so today we are doing a makeup trend that is trending in 2021 so we're going to beat up this face so if you have not yet subscribed do well to hit the subscribe button give me a big thumbs up if you like the video comment and share with now let's go straight into the video so we start as usual prepping our brows that right, to last all day i'm now lining with davis number three eye pencil i start filling in from the inner corner and when i get to the outer corner i do a highlight trance so since i was too lazy to look for my spoolie i had to use this to come out the front of the brow so to line my lower brow, I'm going with this Zaron foundation, it's two shade lighter. So I use it to line my bottom line, bottom brows. After that I blend it in with my middle finger. To line my upper brow i'm going in with this zikel foundation i put the link in the description and um, the shade name in the description box below so after lining too i i blend it in with my middle finger so that when i'm applying foundation later it won't give i won't have too much issue blending it in so for my eyeshadow base i went back in with that zaron foundation apply it on my lid area and blend it in with my middle finger i love my middle finger so i starting with um an orange shade as my first transition color i applied on both eyes blend it using a circular motion So for this side of the eye, I'm going in with this orange, this red from V Beauty Eyeshadow Palette and I dab it into my outer crease area, apply using a dabbing motion. For my second color, I went in with this seal from that V Beauty, this orange seal from that V Beauty Eyeshadow Palette. I dab, 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 dab. So for the third color, I went in with this yellow from Zika eyeshadow palette to run that pigmented. But I, I did manage it since I didn't have an, an, another yellow. So I went back in with the Nubian 2 when that orange from the Nubian 2 eyeshadow palette to blend it all in. So for the other side of my eyes, that's the right side of my eyes, I started with this purple in the outer crease. I dab it into my outer crease. You build it as you go. So for the second color, went in with this blue as my middle color. Dab, 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 dab. So for my last color, this is also blue, right? Please guys, I don't I don't know too much of colors. Please comment what color is this? I think it's blue, but a different shade of blue. So I apply using a dabbing motion. Still went back in with that first new band two and uh, orange from new band two to blend everything in. So I'm not lining my wing eye. I do same for the other eyes. So onto the face, I went in with my Nivea body cream for moisturizer, for my primer, I went in with that Pons Lasting Oil Primer, I applied it all over my T-zone, the place I 
I produce all, all the moves in my kids, it's all over my face, all over my face. So I went back in with that Zikel foundation. I'm stippling it in with this foundation brush using a dabbing motion. I'm not dragging, I'm dabbing for maximum courage. You dab, 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 dab. So I went in because my lash was tacky to apply the lash went back in to blend in my neck so for my my in my highlights I went in with the LA girl pro concealer in the shade phone I apply under my under eyes my chin the bridge of my nose and my forehead And I'm dabbing it in with a damn beauty sponge. And guys, it's good if you don't drag it all over the place, just dab it in. So to set the highlighted part of my face, I go in with the black opal powder. I'm using a brush to do this. I set it in immediately since I don't bake. So immediately I finish blending, I set it immediately. So for my contour and all that good stuff, I'm going in with this double professional powder palette and I'm applying my contour from the highest point of my ear using a circular motion so that there will be no harsh tricks and I use just one shade darker otherwise you can call it I'm just bronzing so I contour my forehead too since I don't want to look like as if I have a max on so for my nose contour I went in with a smaller brush and I start immediately below my brows try and blend it in I do the same for the other side of my nose so I use my finishing powder to blend everything in so for the lower side of my eyes I'll go in this side with the other color of the eyes that means purple or the blue first then the purple then the other side of my face and the eye I go in with the red the orange and the yellow like you that swish what you did for the other eyes you do it for this side so I went in with the black a gel liner to line my waterline so for highlights seizing the that's the Avo professional powder palette highlight the tip of my nose I blend the bridge of my nose I blend and my cubic bow I like highlighting my cubic bow before I apply lipstick so that it don't change the structure so I highlight my chin too. Okay, that one I was putting a blush on first. Then I highlight this chin just directly above my contour. So my for the lips, I'm going in with two different colors too. This purple on the other um top part of my mouth. And red on the lower part of my brows <laughs> uh, on my lips sorry <laughs> on my lips not brows what's wrong with me with brows so I make sure they are all well blended in so guys this is the final look hope you do you subscribe to this makeup trend do you think you can rock it share your thoughts on the comment section about the look so until the next video, 
बाय